It's like two doubles. Two doubles? Yeah. So you're going to put two pieces in there? Yeah, yeah. Oh, whoever is eating this, right? How the hell are you going to put that monster in your Give mouth? Mind blowing stuff. Is it? I walked into. I'm a stone. And they even give me a cheese. Oh, nice serious cheese. Welcome to the Ladypool Road. Behind me is Three in One Burger, and this is your official beaters review. Guys, welcome to the Ladypool Road. I'm back once again because there's a new joint. Do you remember these guys? Three in One Burger, right? Check this video out. They was on an industrial estate, and they were cooking up these mad burgers, and they had mad, mad queues outside. They've now decided Ladypool Road's the place. Let's go on in. Let's check out the food. Let's see if it's the same as what it was, or have they improved on their menu? Follow me. Let me up with a bright smile on now Put me in the dark, don't won't get lost now To the moonlight I see you, Maria right now three in one burger if you remember right these guys we found these guys in Aston on an industrial estate and they were serving up really really good burgers from a caravan literally a caravan and they had queues outside and loads of you said have you ever tried three in one burger I was like I'm not going on no dodgy unit estate right I'm going to try a burger but you know what I was so wrong guys I'm out trying to discover new food places do not forget to hit the like subscribe and the bell icon here comes the rest of your video they were brilliant they were really really good a uh, bunch of lads right they're all brothers family run business and you know what they built this three in one burger and they brought fair play to you guys you know what? i'm really proud of you well done the food really did need to come main street which they've done they've been doing this for like three months they are busy as hell i'm extremely sorry it's taking me so long even to come with this invite right but you know what without further ado i think it's time to order it's a burger joint it's gotta have to be burgers isn't it right i want to go for something which is not on their menu which is a spicy chicken burger i know up north in manchester Bradford, right a lot of people have sent me invites right to come and check out their burgers it's basically chicken fillet sort of fried chicken fillet and then dipped into a chili sauce so you get a, like a wet chicken chili burger and loads of people have been reviewing it saying it's really mental as far as I know three in one burger the only people in Birmingham that are actually serving this up that's one I'm going to go for then it's a charcoal sizzler we had this last time it's your chicken burger I want you to try another chicken burger and then I'm going for the eight ounce smash burger we're going to have to try some beef aren't we right it's a must when you try burgers right let's have a look what's so different about how they were making it before and how they're making it now they've got quite a bit of room kitchen action to the back end of three in one if you remember previously right it was a small joint it was a caravan it was literally we could not move in there so we were filming from the outside it's bigger it's better they must be doing something right have i i got people hiding it's not one of them films right and these guys are preparing our order our spicy burger we've gone for a smash burger and we've gone for a charcoal classic burger let's see if we can get some cooking action how about you sir are you okay yeah. yeah how long have you been working here for? three, three months, four yeah. months yeah, yeah. you must be good because it's really busy out there yeah yeah so busy. is this the chicken burger the spicy one yeah this one it's not spicy beer. this one just a taco sauce and left uh seen with this cheese burger okay yeah one chocolate one is this a famous one yeah, yeah it's nice i've ordered this one yeah yeah, yeah? yeah one, so one. is this very very chilly no it's uh, another one what, what, i'm not gonna die or anything like yeah, that yeah. no which one is one is personal 
the guy said I'm not gonna die. It should be alright. Yeah. I'm gonna take his word on it. He looks like what he's, he, he looks like. He knows what he's talking about. But tell me, this is the magic machine over here. There's about eight seconds left, and this is Ali. Ali is the guy that operates this machine. This is where the magic happens with the chicken. I don't know. Ali, you ready? Yeah. Two seconds. You better do something quick. Whoa! Looks like he's gonna pull up. Ali, what's going on? Why is there smoke all over the place? This is the pressure, right? Yeah. So this is cooked under pressure. Should I stay away? This thing going up like a smoke alarm? Here we go. Ali's doing the trick. Whoa. Okay. Ooh. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Chicken fillets. What sort of heat is this we're talking? What sort of heat? 162 degrees. You don't want to get your fingers in there, right? 162 degrees. Now, from what I understand, they're making this mad burger, right? I only found up in the north, right? Manchester, Bradford. I've got loads of emails from guys from the north saying, you're going to try our chicken dipped. He's doing it. I'm going to be quiet. So the chicken comes out and then, oh, that's a spice. And it stays wet. Oh, straighten the burger. I can't lie, that looks pretty appetizing. He's doing it again. Ali, wait. Ali's too fast for the job. Ali, one more. It's like two doubles. Two doubles? Yeah. So you're going to put two pieces in there? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Whoever is eating this right, how the hell are you going to put that monster in your mouth? I have to come back in the kitchen, right? Because this is a different kitchen. Everybody wants to go on camera. This is Emma. Emma, how are you? Hey. You are the smash burger specialist, huh? Yes, sir. Okay. So Emma, Emma is that keen to go on camera? We have to come back to do the kitchen. Oh yeah. Emma, how long you been smashing burgers for? Uh, three months. Three months. Yes. So you're pretty new at this job, right? Yes, yes. So you're keen. You're eager, right? Why, why should people come and have your smash burger? Because we are the best. We make our, all our patients in this and uh, we try to make our most every day. Whoa! Oh, it smells like. 100% beef? Yes, yes. HMC beef? Yes, yes, sir. HMC beef, what's this? Yeah. Oh, what's this? This is a sauce. This is a bomb sauce. Ah. Yeah. Oh, this is, I remember this from the, of the, house. From the caravan in Aston. These guys are doing this mad sauce on. A little bit of cheese. As you can see, right? Mozzarella. Oh, yeah, mozzarella. Some of the orange cheeseburger cheese. And we finish with this special sauce. Yes. Are you married? No. No? Have you ever thought of uh, registering with the Beard and Bros Marriage Network? Huh? We have a marriage network. We can get you married? Uh... I'm being serious? <laughs> see? He makes a burger, I get him married. It's a deal. Come on in, the food's here. I have to do the monster for this oh, 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 oh. We saw this cooking earlier, right? Goes out that mental machine. And then, oh, oh yeah. It's a wet chicken burger. Right, there we go. Oh. Mm. Oh, yeah. mm. Still gonna crunch? What? I thought you'd be losing it because being dipped on. You've got such a spicy cook. What a different, different burger, absolutely beautiful. Definitely different from anything you're going to eat in Birmingham. It's got such a spicy thick I can feel the crunch of the second fried chicken. It's a nice thick piece of chicken as well. You know what? That's a showstopper. Which I enjoyed more than the beef. This was the charcoal sizzler. Just for every day. Chicken burger. 
But it was barbecued, right? Barbecued chicken, not fried, barbecued. Tandoori mm. chicken. It's no nonsense. To the point, garlic mayo. Made in house by these lads. It's such a healthier option. Right, more than that. And it's a no nonsense. Chicken burger. I've got one more to go. It's the Adam Smash Burger. I'm still sweating off the chili burger. You know what? It's a noise. I can feel it around my mouth. It's a really, really good kick. Because chicken burgers are quite bland. Back to the beginning. So we had to go for the eight downs. Smash patty. If you remember, this was Emma downstairs. He called us back in. Oh, I think about four patties in this big monster. Mmm. That is so juicy. Mm. Well, hey, Jim, see, approve, beef. What are we doing downstairs? Smashing the patty, putting this sauce on it, then mozzarella, then cheese, and then another sauce. Right, so it wasn't just a, like a smash patty, it was like their own homemade version of a smash patty. And you know what? That really comes through. Smokiness, right? It's really wet. That's the word for it, not dry at all. Mm. That there. It's gotta be one of the best beef burgers in Birmingham. Honestly, that's gonna give anybody a run for their money. Look at that. Look how juicy that is. There you have it. That was three in one burger in the new place over in Lady Pool Road. Not a dull moment comes to mind. Not a dull moment at all. We, we tried three burgers. Let me go for the charcoal grilled chicken burger. It's like the doodly chicken. Right. Juicy, no nonsense burger. Then we went for the eight ounce beef smash patty. Totally different ball game with these guys smash patty. What they're doing? They're putting like a homemade sauce on it, then they're putting mozzarella, then they're putting some uh, burger, cheese, and then another sauce is added. Overall, the meat itself is so juicy, and then the sauce just makes it ooze, literally. And then what everybody else is eating in this restaurant, right, is going to be that mental, massive, southern fried, dipped chicken burger. I don't need to go to Manchester anymore to only have one right what a burger yeah. really dark marks like i said with all the burgers not a dumb moment I'm, I'm you know what pleasantly surprised they have come leaps and bounds from that industrial unit to this shop and they have maintained and probably gone beyond their standard they set over there they're busy for a reason this is a no-nonsense proper professional burger joint you want a burger it's definitely going to be three in one burger but overall this is what they are scoring. You are watching him right and carry on watching the beat of views. If you have to try that stuff, mind blowing stuff. It's because if I walk into I'm a stone fan and they've even given me a cheese. Oh, nice serious cheese.